I have a report you might find interesting. It tells of a chasm in the Vinmark Mountains, and a secret that was said to be buried within. Yet when the Chantry went to investigate, they were turned away by the Grey Wardens. And why would I find that interesting? Because the Champion was there. I can't help but notice you failed to mention this adventure. Oh, that? I didn't think you'd be interested. Just some business with Hawk's family. A, a few Carter dwarves who went too far. <sighs> You're not going to believe me. I'll take my chances. All right. Don't say I didn't warn you. There it is. That's where these dwarves are? These are Carter dwarves. So they're more criminals and smugglers than anything else. They're not usually stupid, though. I don't know why they'd attack you. They snuck into the gallows. If there hadn't been Templars to stop them. <laughs> don't feel left out. They've been trying to kill me for several days now. You have a plan, then? I found their hideout, but my sources couldn't tell me anything else. It's all very strange. Why do you say that? It's just the Carter, isn't it? As far as my contacts and the Carter know, they shouldn't be here. There shouldn't even be a here. Well, this place is invisible. A big blind spot on the map. Bianca's never been this suspicious. And she's twitchy to start with. Does it matter? We just need them to stop trying to kill us. A fine point. So, what's the plan? Oh, I'm sure this is all a misunderstanding. Later, we'll all have tea and we'll laugh. Oh, your name is Hawk. I thought it was Locke. <laughs> I can't believe you two are joking about this. <laughs> Don't worry, sunshine. The laughter just hides the pain. Whatever happens, they won't get a chance to attack again. At least the Circle let me come. I didn't want you to do this alone. Let's go. You! Both sisters! You're here together! You've come! Is he referring to you and me? Everyone! It's the children of Malcolm Hawk! They've come to us! What does my father have to do with this? It began with him! ...and ends with you. Blood for blood, that's what we were told. Did... ...father do something to the Carter? You've come to us now, and that's the only thing that matters. You tell me. How could I refuse such a delightfully worded invitation? We must have the blood. You don't understand. Oh, blood. Why didn't you just ask? We will take it. Corypheus will walk in the sun once more. Did you hear that? They're after us. For our blood. But why? Crazy people like blood. A lot. Clearly these dwarves are insane. Perhaps even more so than Varric. I heard that. The Carter doesn't normally act like this. They're businessmen. I'd like to know who this Corypheus is. <laughs> With a name like that, he's bound to go mwahaha at some point. I just know it. And really? More blood? Why can't it ever be spit? Or a lock of hair? You really want to encounter a spit mage? For variety, sure. The hawk's blood. The master will rise. He will be free. Garav? Beric? No, no one told me you would be part of this. We were just going after the Hawk. Why has the Carter been attacking me? I can't say. The Master must be free. Really, Gaurav? I thought better of you than this. I mean, gutting the occasional competitor for fun and profit, that's the game. But what are you all even doing here? Worshipping demons? We drink the Darkspawn blood. He calls us. Why would you do that? Won't you just die? It's the only way to hear the music. Oh, come on, you nug licker. Snap out of it. There's no gold in hallucinating. Manners, Varric. Introduce me to your lunatic friend. Hawk, this is Garav. He's a greedy, brilliant bastard son of a nug from the Carter. Garav, this is Hawk. The one whose blood you want to drink or bathe in or whatever. 
But if you're after eternal youth, I've got to tell you, she's no virgin. The master is calling. He needs the blood. Garav, buddy. This isn't like you. Look, I've still got Bianca. Never misfired a day in her life. You don't want her to see her papa like this, do you? Varric, you want to spare this bastard? Not if he's after you, Hawk. Bianca, I think it's time to say goodbye. You poor, stupid bastard. I used to do business with the Carta. Back in the day. Garav was a nutcase then, too, but in a good way. He was trying to design a new type of repeating crossbow. Bianca was the only one that ever worked. I can't believe he ended up like that. Hawk, they told me you were going to be trouble. And look, you brought the whole family. How generous. I swore to Corypheus we'd bring him Malcolm Hawk's blood, one way or the other. What does this have to do with my father? The Master wants you. I don't ask why. So, it's Corypheus who's after me? What Corypheus wants, Corypheus gets. From us, or from someone. Corypheus wants some blood? Sure. Let me just open a vein. Oh, how about a kidney, too? Corypheus, we have done as you command. Your sacrifice is here! You will see the surface once more! What the...? What is this? I can feel it inside me! Oh, that is a strange one. They don't have one of those in the circle. And it was father's. This is going to take me to Corypheus. <laughs> <laughs>